Now we have collected all the data for our gyratory specimen. Now from this selected and the computer data, we have to draw the data curves. Actually draw of data curves means we have to plot a graph. The first graph which we are going to plot it is between airwide versus PB graph. Now the question is how will we do? Just for your understanding, here I would like to tell you the value of VA is known to be uh, 5.7 4.3, 3 and 2.1 and this value is calculated for this uh, binder content uh, 4.1, 4.6, 5.1 and 5.6 clear it now I will draw the graph this is the first ever graph which we have to consider first and how will I draw it? You will have to take special consideration. Four at the origin, four point two, four point four, four point six, four point eight. 5, 5.2, 5.4, 5.6 and at the last is I will find it point eight. Now, this is the value of our binder content PP being increased to the right hand side. Similarly, the air wires 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7, etc. Here, let me show you. When my binder content is 5.1, the air wide is 5.7. It means I am at this point. When my binder content is 4.6, and the binder content 4.6 having the air wide 4.3. It means I am nearly at this point. When binder content is 3 and 5 air wide is uh, sorry. When the for this 5.1 air wide is 3. It means nearly I am at this point. For this binder content 5.6 air wide is 2.1. Let us put it like this. Now from this graph, whatever we have plotted over here, when I will join them, we are going to cut this line. Clear it. This is the graph between air wines and the PB content. Now here, I would like to tell you one thing, super pave specification say 4% air wide will be taken into consideration. What I say, 4% air wide will be taken into consideration in order to find out the amount of binder content. So, so as per the super pave specification, when I go to this one, and I am going to touch at this point. This is the point of touch. From this point of touch, I will find out what is the value of the binder content coming. So, so it is coming at this point. So this point shows that the value of PB comes out to be 4.7%. The value of air while as per super specification is 4%.
this is very very important but super base specification say you will have to study this preliminary graph with respect to four percent air void so i have drawn this parallel line where it is going to touch this curve from this curve i am going downwards to our our binder content where it is touching to my x axis i have found the value of pp it coming l 4.7 where va is equal to 4% so, so this is my final in my all other graph i will try to see it that whether this 4.7% binder content is going to satisfy our other requirements or not so preliminary graph i have explained to you and inshallah in my next video i will go on explaining one by one each and every type of the graph thank you